right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Skellica. Let's play. Yes, you've heard it right. We're back. We are revived, and here we are. And we're playing a PC game. Okay. Well, that's the thing. So we're just going to jump right into it. Just me today, right now, with this gameplay. Uh, we are going to be playing, uh, what the hell's the name of this game? World of Warship Online. Great game. Visually stunning. We're going to go into battle uh, as a Wyoming class battleship and we're just going to get right into it all right so while we're waiting on this game to load i hope everyone's well hope everyone's excited skelica is back we are producing content this will be our first let's play and it's a single person let's play uh just because i'm boss like that and i love this game visually stunning and like i said before we're playing a game on pc so stay tuned and let's go kill some enemies. Let's see. If you guys aren't familiar with this game, uh, get familiar with it. This game is just Action stations. This is the co-op battle, uh, all human versus AI. And that's why I go into competitive because you know, I'm a bitch. Just kidding. It's just a good way to get warmed up. And uh, let's see. Yeah, sure, or whatever. Just good luck, everybody. Let's give them a hard time. Yeah, let's start to make our luck. Now, this game scales really well. Um, as we can see there, that ship's approximately, according to the game, 1.9 kilometers away. Uh, that's probably pretty realistic in terms of scale. Uh, this game is just beautiful. Uh, especially when you're using the NVIDIA Pascal based uh, devices. It's just flat out gorgeous. Beautiful game go out by yourself uh, any decent game, game graphics card whatever I'm not gonna sit here and tell you NVIDIA is better than uh, who's those crap AMD but I'll tell you I use NVIDIA over top of AMD because I prefer it. but I'm not in the mood to start a PC master race war so uh, let's you know we're rolling up here into battle uh, we're gonna go for Bravo objective good chunk of the team is going for Alpha, we need at least one cruiser going for Bravo, and uh, let's get ourselves into some battle here. Alright, we're going to start making our way into battle here, we can see at uh, 12 kilometers out we already have made contact with the ships. And we're going to throw the optics up and see what we can figure out here. So this is an objective based gameplay uh, with the uh, kind of slow up. we have got to keep an eye on what's coming around the corners because I'll sneak up on you real quick because you know you'll have six ships on top of it. There's five in my field of view here. Alright, we're in battle. Time for a hard left turn. Get some more guns on the station here to attack you. Dead ahead. Oh crap, we're about to take a hit. Torpedoes. We're taking on water. Let's close them doors. Oh, 
we are just being pummeled by torpedoes. These guns also take a long time to reload. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna blow up. Alright, great way to start off this. Let's play. My Wyoming has some. Uh, because I don't want to sit here and wait uh, 28 minutes for this to re this game to end. We're just gonna go ahead and exit the port and pick another ship and enter another event for the chance. If not, we're gonna be stuck here all day. So Alright, Wyoming's in battle. Let's take a look at Hmm. Let's go with the Indianapolis. Oh, just guns galore. Nope, I changed my mind. Let's go to Atlanta. Yeah, there we go. Is that not just a beautiful looking boat? I mean, you have to, you know, have an appreciation for it to understand why it's so beautiful, but just drop dead gorgeous. So uh, we do have some extra added onto this boat, uh, some radar stations, advanced anti-aircraft, torpedoes, and between 5 and 11 guns on this long range cannons on this. I don't really remember. Uh, but all in all, just a flat out beautiful ship. So uh, we'll go ahead and get this loaded up and get underway. Alright, we're about 10 seconds away from starting gameplay and you can just see again how visually stunning the water just looks great. Textures. And oh my, look at that. Just, just what a gorgeous game. Nice little lens flare there. And uh, yeah, we have eight main cannons. I did remove a couple of the main cannons and I did away for some of the additionals. Like I had thought. Uh, this is one fast son of a bitch right here as well. Uh, we do have a torpedoes on left or right side, depending on obviously which direction we're facing. Um, better advanced anti-aircraft guns and a radar station. A little dipshit cutting right across in front of us because you know that's real smart. And, uh, so. We're gonna roll up on in battle here real quick. Uh, I don't think I've ever completed a round with this ship. Uh, this ship is very lightly armored, it's built for speed and destruction, but it's not very good at defending itself mainly because it, the whole purpose of it. I think it's in the cruiser. Is to get in quick, inflict damage, and get out. But I don't like to uh, run away like a bitch. So I don't typically make it out of battle with these things. It normally sinks to the bottom of the ocean. And we are already under fire, so. Basic action already. as retaliation. Son of a bitch. They're running about as fast as I am running. And I'm me, so I did not reach anywhere near far enough. And we are already on fire. The ship is on fire. Major oh my god, damaged. help. Problem solved, sir. Get a radar on station. Probably planes in the area. Long range radar spun up now. We're pretty much done for. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw some torpedoes out there quick. Yeah, I'm about to go through. Yep, there we are. Let's go. A week, son of a bitch, and my torpedoes aren't going to come close to hitting anything, so there we are, first one out. Well, that sucks. And just like that, we're going to sink to the bottom of the Pacific Ocean and be done. So, let's go ahead and exit the port one more time here. Uh, Erie, St. Louis. I think St. Louis. Hmm. Haven't had this bad boy out for a while. Oh, nope. Wyoming's back. That battle just ended. So we're going to take this bastard of a warship back in the battle. 
Very good armament, very good long range weaponry. Um, just flat out love this ship compared to pretty much every ship I use. This is the one that I go to all the time. So let's go ahead, we'll let this game load up and we'll see if we can maybe win a round. All right, about 15 seconds away from uh, round start, and it is snowing. Got snow sticking to my TV screen, and again, just beautiful graphics, st visually stunning game. I just blown away by this game. Um, out of all the world of whatever type of destructive view that has come out there, world of planes, and world of tanks, world of warships is just without, without a doubt my favorite. Um, I don't know why. I just have a thing for boats, I guess. But, uh, it's just a drop dead gorgeous game, so, game, game, blah, 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 blah. Alright, that's why I still can't talk. Even after an almost two year hiatus from the, from doing this, I just sound like a bubbling idiot, so. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and roll on up in the battle here. Uh, this is just a standard battle, just with bases or something. You can actually kind of capture them the base and win. Uh, but these games never make it that far, so maybe this time around we will, uh, maybe we'll get a win in. So, you can see my massive freaking battleship here. Uh, all these are World War II era for the most part. And I have, but whatever. Beautiful ships. And uh, I just fade through that booty. Alright, we can see things are starting to populate on the screen here in front of us. Ships are being spotted, enemy ships. Got one off to... I'm not gonna do an article, I'm just gonna say the fucking right deal with it. At about 9 kilometers, but we're gonna target this one on our left because it's already engaging us. Alright. Three away. Two away. Alright, we got some hits on him early. Um, we're gonna lose Sullivan right there. He's gonna... He's gonna behind that island and we're not going to be able to take shots on him. Uh, so, uh, our upper angles, I'm not able to take shots on him. I'll hit the, I'll hit the island. Uh, gotta get the guns turned here. The back guns are going to take forever to turn. So we are being attacked pretty hard now from our right. Yeah, I don't care. I'm not using my deal with it. I'm not a sailor. I just, I just like this game a lot. Alright, guns coming into range now, and two of them. So we got our four aft guns. Oh, see, I guess I do know aft. They're still trying to turn away. Uh, we do have side mount mounted cannons that are going to start shooting as we get into range. I don't know if they're going to shoot their own free will. Speed up here because they're gonna probably be for fuel speed off that ship out of and I don't want to be a city. throw a full rudder as much as we can to the right side. Try to keep our guns in range of this bastard. We are taking this motherfucker Give her a good one, full 360 here. And now put us back in range of these guys. We are on fire. Cool. Torpedoes to start. Oh god. Torpedoes to 
Torpedoes to starboard. We're gonna take a real nasty hit here. Oh, torpedoes, we were out of range, but we have to hear that disappear. Couple nice hits there. We are still on fire. Fire crew have not been able to contain those uh, those fires yet on that deck. That actually does cause damage. Um, Play, uh, it will slowly drag down the ship's health, so you know that's one thing that we'll hopefully get under control here soon. Two away. I'm just gonna keep pummeling these guys with everything I've got. Uh, that's about all I can do at this point. Hey, this looks like one we're gonna win, so that's all that matters. Three cannons away. Two remaining on the ship are in range of my cannons, so. And I do have some big cannons, I am a battleship. So got three of them that are close. Alright, put down to one ship. Bing, bada boom, a couple good shots. The entire fleet is firing on this one ship. We are not letting them get away. I just missed. And he's done, and just like that, we have achieved victory. Alright. So, boom. Just like that. But, uh,. Hey guys, that's going to actually do it for us on this first Let's Play. Uh, I appreciate you all for uh, joining us. Welcome back to Skelica Let's Play. Uh, this is what we are calling the revival. We are bringing her out of retirement. Uh, been a lot, very busy two years for myself and Jake and the rest of the SKP team. Uh, but it's time. We're back. Look for some content. This is Kyle. Out.